Something is missing in downtown Watertown. The historic fountain on Public Square was removed by crane this morning. 7 News reporter Sandy Torres tells us about a restoration project and plans to add another water feature downtown. Public Square's historic fountain is strapped in and ready to head down south. It will go to Alabama and be sandblasted. Josh Short is with the restoration team and says the fountain is not in bad shape, but it does need a pick-me-up. The fountain will get a detailed paint job. Helping this fountain find the fountain of youth will cost around $100,000. Any parts that are rotted away will be patched. Like these leaves will have to come all the way off. And this lion's head will come all the way off. Short says it will take several months before the fountain returns to the city, but that it will be worth the wait. It's, it's, it's a neat fountain. We'll have it back and looking brand new. Downtown Watertown won't be fountainless for long. Here on Court Street, right behind me, there will be a fountain popping up sometime this summer. There will be a fountain on Court Street. You can see the base already constructed with the cobblestone pattern and the cylindrical shape. Really, the only thing we are missing from it is water. The city says this fountain will be a simple water stream. The city's planning department hopes to showcase it at a ribbon cutting ceremony for the work done on Court Street sometime this summer. Sandy Torres, 7 News.